Okay, in is a nice keyword to use. Um, what in does is it lets us put something in a list. So if I've got um, several things I want to do, I could go with this a couple of ways. Let's say I want to say select um, member, let's do films, films dot film name and films dot year released oops, from films. And I want to say, uh, let's say where, show me just films where the year released was 1967. You guys have seen this before, right? That's my, my most simple find there, right? I can, I can find those are the ones just in 1967. But if I wanted to do more of those, I might say, and I also want to see the ones where films released was uh, 1985, 19, I don't know if these are real years or not. I'll change them if I need to to make it make more sense. And films year released equals 1987 and I could keep doing these and this would get really really long and annoying let go and see if any show up All right so it's not going to be because the end is a bad choice they're not going to be released in more than one year so or or that makes more sense all right, so we can see that I did have some in 87, 67. I don't have any in 85, that's okay. But that gets really long. So another way to do this might be, and I'm gonna leave this in here and I'm gonna write it again and then delete that one, where films.year released is in, now I can just say 1967, 1985, 1987. Now that is exactly the same thing as this line, but you can see that's a whole lot more convenient. So if I've got a whole bunch of ORs that I need to do, um, I can do this in instead. I still get exactly the same result, um, but it's a whole lot less typing. So there you go, that's in.